Hi guys, my name is Nasrin and in today's video, I want to show you what is Elsevier Journal Finder. In this regard, before answer this question, I prefer to tell you just a story uh, for preparing a paper and some tips. So, you know, you devoted several months or maybe a year to writing the paper. Suppose that you did all the things and prepare your manuscript and did a perfect job. Now, it is the time uh, to choose a journal that is fit enough to submit your paper, your article. Take attention. You know, the publication uh, process can often take several months. Due to this process, you would get exposed to several problems, such as slowing career progress, missing opportunities, and maybe losing your thesis score. So these are really big issues. Therefore, we should know that getting a research paper published can be challenging for authors. And it's even more challenging when a journal rejects authors, authors' articles because it is out of scope. So in this time, you would be worried and upset due to this rejection. Therefore, as a researcher, you should strive to choose the best journal for publishing your research paper. One of the famous publisher is Elsevier. Elsevier put a tool in its website to ease this process for you, publication and select, I mean the select journal. So as a VA finder helps you find journals and uh, find journals that could be best suited for publishing your research paper. So for better understanding this uh, tool, as a VA journal finder, let's start it by take, uh, I mean that, uh, see this website. If you search in the web, uh, in Google, and write Elsevier Journal Finder, and then enter, you can find it in this web, in this page. And then by clicking, you can uh, find this uh, Journal Finder too. Okay, Journal Finder has a different uh, sub sessions, sub uh, sections, and I start with the first one. The first one is paper title. Uh, the second one is paper abstract that you should uh, try to put the abstract in this one. When you scroll down, you can see the keywords. You can put the keywords, relevant keywords of your paper here and then field of research. By scrolling down, you can see different uh, title uh, research, uh, I mean that paper's title. And then after uh, you can see and uh, refine your research if you click this uh, uh, icon here, you can see, uh, I mean, the different scope, different publication type, uh, open access and subscription. Uh, I suggest you and invite you to watch the previous video uh, in Agrimus of a YouTube uh, channel that I told all the things about open access and subscription. You can follow this uh, video and uh, distinct their differences. Next item uh, is journal impacts. You can see impact a factor and site score. And by a scroll uh, left or right, you can change uh, these icons to reduce or maybe increase the impact factor and less and rest. So the last item is review and publication time is really important for us due to our, uh, I mean, that speed and uh, see what's happened for our papers after reviewer process and the others. The first uh, item is time to first decision and the second one time to publication. If you uh, stop a while here, you can see a good a tip about time to first decision and rest. So I don't want to clear for other things because it's really easy to understand. So I prefer to show you an example. Okay, start with the first one, paper title. You know, 
for the paper title, I uh, copy and paste from my paper, the title of the subject of the paper, I copy and paste here. Then after for paper abstract, I, do, uh, I did it. I copy and paste here for abstract of the paper and for the keywords, you know, it's really, it's really good things to know that, for example, for with crop, I delete it and want to add it again uh, with crop. You know, if before I uh, uh, type the rest, I can see several uh, different uh, words that helps me to put a better keywords for my paper. It's another, uh, I mean, that uh, I, a good option for us to find the best keywords for our paper, okay? So I put a with a crop here, and then for the next, uh, uh, excuse me, I omitted it. I skip it, the with crop again, with crop, yeah. And then click it. You can uh, uh, put all the keywords of your paper in this part, in this section. For the field of research, you know, since there are lots of different subjects in as uh, um, field for the papers, uh, you can select some of them, but I prefer to select none of them because maybe in some fields, my paper would be related to some of the other areas. So I uh, don't select anything for field of research. You can select it, but, but in my site, I didn't, uh, I never select anything. Anyhow, for refine your search, also, as I told you before, you can define and disconnect some of the things, but I also omit this one. I don't want to uh, put the, some criteria for my, um, I mean, the items. Anyhow, then after I can click find journals. You need some time to uh, find several pay, uh, journals in Elsevier. And Journal Finder did a very fantastic job for you and in a very short time. For example, Journal of Earth Environments, Journal of Hydrology, Agriculture and Forest Meteorology, and blah, 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 blah to end. You can see a, a very good list that you can pick up some of them as a good journal for you. But if you want to know that what are the characterization of uh, each journal, uh, you can see several things. The first thing is related to top matching keywords. For example, for my selected keywords, it's really good match with this one. Side score, impact factor, you can see acceptance rate is really important. If you are in rush, it would be better to pick up some uh, highest one. For example, in, it, is, it has 20% rate, but it has 27%. And also you should make decision. You should make this uh, decision that uh, do you uh, have, um, I mean, that rush or uh, some you need to speed up your process. So you should select the first decision at least uh, Rex. So in this uh, journal, you can see that the time to first decision, six weeks, and time to publication, three weeks. What does it mean? It means that uh, the process that uh, reviewers uh, uh, send back the ideas to the editors of their journal. And after all the things were uh, would be finalized, it is the time to publish your paper. Okay, I think you can, at this uh, time, you understand all the things about Journal Finder. So what the other uh, publishers, if we want to know these questions, uh, Springer, IEEE, Wiley, and different other publishers, if you want to uh, good knowledge about these uh, icons, uh, I suggest you watch the next video. Okay, at the end, please subscribe to our channel. Please don't forget to share it and uh, to give uh, this video's thumbs up. Uh, put your comments and questions below, below the video uh, would help us to better understand your uh, ideas about uh, other videos. Thank you so much. Have a nice time. Bye-bye.